more dairy for you now. You can't go to the state fair without appreciating our state's dairy industry. What better way to do that than enjoying a fresh milkshake from Waukesha County dairy farmer John Overhaus. All right, so her cows are supplying the milk for the shakes. Our Waukesha County reporter Rebecca Clough went to see how it all works and met these four experts to see what they think of the fresh dairy. When Joan Overhaus isn't working with her dairy cattle, you can find her here making the milkshakes at the state fair. Toddy and delight. Waukesha dairy farmer Joan Oberhaus has grown up farming. Oh. Can you put a number on it? No. Your whole no, life? No, because then I have to tell you how old I am. All of her dairy cow's milk goes to prairie farms, which you pretty much can find all over the state fair, from the cream puffs to the ice cream. So she tells people. There's a <laughs> chance you could have a little milk from Delight. But when Joan isn't on the farm, she volunteers for the state fair's dairy promotion board. For more than a decade, Joan and the board have wanted to bring milkshakes to the fair's Wisconsin Products Pavilion. And the shake thing was kind of a dream. That finally became a reality two years ago, but Joan didn't just bring the shakes, she makes them. This is one of our cows on the cup. Every day she takes a shift at the booth making shakes with a title that she reluctantly accepts. The milkshake lady. Yeah. And she does it all just to see everyone's enjoyment. What's your review? Um, five stars. Excellent. Really good. It's good. I like it. Reporting at the State Fair, Rebecca Clough, TMJ4 News. Wow, it looks delicious from here. The shakes cost $4 and profits will go towards dairy education and scholarships. Nothing like washing down two cream puffs <laughs> with a milkshake. That's true.